on that side. <laughs> yes, okay. Anyway, it's now time to go back to school, and that means it's back to packing lunches. So we have some brown bag help this morning. We have brought in Dr. Melanie Hart, and she's here to tell us how certain foods can benefit our kids during the school day. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. Fascinating information I think every parent wants to know because early in the morning you want to figure out what's the best brain food to give them to start out the day. Right. And you have some wonderful suggestions. Yes, and it is important to eat breakfast so that their blood sugar level doesn't drop during the day as well. And, and so what should we be giving them first thing in the morning? A good source of protein would be good and some healthy carbs. And so what are some examples of a good source of protein? A good source of protein would be chicken or turkey, you okay. know, maybe peanut butter, even some nuts or something like that. And what Eggs. if your kid is allergic to nuts? Is allergic to nuts. We were just discussing that, that my child insists that he is allergic to nuts and doesn't eat a lot of protein. Well, your choices would be eggs or maybe even a protein drink, something like this that's kind of fruity tasting that they might enjoy. And why is that so important early in the morning? Um, it helps your mental concentration because you're getting the amino acids into your system and it helps the brain function a lot better. All right, and how much of that should we be insisting that our children eat during the morning hours? It is important, so they should at least get like three grams, 19 grams in the morning. Okay, great, and you say complex carbohydrates enhance focus and every parent wants to make sure that when that kid walks into the school they are hyper focused and so they're what, paying attention yes absolutely and what are those types of foods we can have the whole grains like the um, a whole wheat muffin that's or carrot muffin something like that would be really good um, even some of the fruits and vegetables or some of the healthy carbs and you could put snacks like um, pretzels and stuff like that in their lunch. All right, and you have also here another, I thought this was really great because it's yeah. all self-contained there. Right, right. So you've got some healthy celery option in there. I'll turn it around so you can take a look at it. And then in this little container, it's packing some peanut butter. Right, peanut butter again. So this is kind of good for parents on the go that maybe right. don't have the time to do right. this for their children. Right. All right, and then the last probably most important thing I think is the water. Right. And what is, why do you say that's so important for your child? They need to be hydrated and help to detox the body and just keep everything moving. And you brought some water. I think this, you know, I've, I've really been leery of buying yes. the vitamin water, right. thinking, well, can't I just give my kids, you know, vitamins in the foods? But you say this is a good option. Why? Well, this is a good option because it has a little bit of flavor and it will encourage kids to drink a little bit more water because they typically would rather go for a soda or something like a fruit juice even that has maybe a little bit too much sugar. So this is a great choice. And how much of that should they be drinking on a daily basis, um, like a one elementary age child? You know, a good 8 to 32 ounces, depending on their body weight. All right, great. So okay. wonderful, healthy options, and of course, lots of fruits and vegetables. Sure. How do you get them to eat that if they don't like it, though? You slowly <laughs> introduce things like that and like yogurts and things like that and eventually they'll get cleaned up and enjoy it. All right. Well, Dr. Melanie Thank Hart, you. we appreciate it. Thank you very much. Pleasure. Thank Rob, you. I'm going to steal some of this food for myself. What, <laughs> what would you like? The celery for the wings that I'd like to eat before oh, that Oh, there story. you go. Oh, see, that's not so good. For more information, of course, you can always log on to our website, NBC5.com. Make sure that you click on the As Seen On link. All right. Mr.